What's wrong with Chapman? Chappie, it was his knee again that uh, did not feel right. So um, same spot as he's felt before. Um, so just got him out of there. And so we'll, we'll get all the testing and stuff done tomorrow just to see what, what exactly. Um, but, you know, usually, you know, it's not really an issue for us. But for him to call us out there, um, you know, obviously we needed to get him out of there. Did he describe the pain as being different or much greater than it had been in the past? No, he said it was very similar, similar, like basically the exact same spot as what he's felt before. Um, I haven't got with him enough to know like level of pain he was feeling this time around compared to other times, but it was enough for him to call us out there. And uh, so we, we needed to get him out of there. When you say testing, what will he have done tomorrow? He'll probably have an MRI and just, um, you know, be examined by doctors and stuff like that, and we'll see where we're at with it. He's a big part of that back end. Where is your level of concern, and what type of blow would that be if he can't throw for a couple of days? Yeah, I mean, because he's managed it so well this year, and, and, you know, we haven't really seen it affect him. And for him to call us out and, um, you know, where, where it was affecting him tonight, um, yeah, it's a huge concern, obviously, because he's a huge part of our club and, and of huge importance at the back end. Was Rob Robertson available tonight? No, Robertson was down. He was a little tender uh, just after playing catch today. Uh, Shoulder-wise, don't think it's a big deal, so we were staying away from him today. Um, so th that's why uh, that's why he didn't get in the game tonight. Was today the first day that he complained of any yeah. pain in his shoulder? Yeah. Yeah, today was the first day. and um, You know, I... I I'm not overly concerned about it. Robbie's not overly concerned about it, but uh, it was a day where he needed a day. With all that being said, do you, do you feel grateful to just get out of here with the win, with, with some of the losses that you've taken? A absolutely. Look, it's it's as I've said a lot in the last couple of weeks. It's it's not easy for us right now. You know, we're going through a, a, a tough stretch, and you know, obviously we've we've had some guys go down. Um, but that's also an opportunity for guys to step up, and we've seen that. We saw it again tonight, you know. You know, Greeny up against it there, gets out of it. Cole up against it, works his way out of it. Tommy coming in in a tough spot and just filling up the strike zone. So really proud of, of, of the guys that have needed to step up uh, coming in and, and, and playing a role in us winning games. And, and uh, so that was a, it was a hard one tonight, but we grinded one out. It's okay. Where do you get that? Say it again. Hicks. Hicks will check on. I think he's okay. Yeah. Is it hand? I think it was more arm. So I, th I think he's. I think he's okay. Uh -uh. Does this change? I mean, you didn't seem terribly, con you know, concerned the last time Chapman mm -hmm. had had to come out of the game. Does this change that dynamic a little bit because it's the second? You know, this is the second. It's, it's certainly. Yeah. It's certainly. You know, I'm concerned about it just because. Um, you know, really, virtually every other time he's been he's been able to work through it. Um, so for him to call attention to it, um, yeah, that has me concerned, and kind of hope for the best tomorrow, and hope we we can get him uh, on the road to recovery. We'll see. We'll you know, I don't want to get too ahead and speculate too much. Let's wait and see what goes on tomorrow. And do you think something was up right away with Chapman because his fastball really wasn't what it normally is? Um. No, no, because, you know, at times this year, you know, we've seen him limp, limp around out there more, certainly more than he did tonight, and the velocity's been there. And I think the one thing we've seen with Chappie, even when he's been effective, is, you know, that fastball velocity has varied a lot this year. Um, and I think that's more a result of mechanics sometimes. I'm sure the knee has played a role in that, no question about it, but I, I wasn't initially alarmed by that you know I was just if he can lock in the strike zone there usually that can kind of come and go velocity wise does he feel it do you guys know if he was feeling anything in the bullpen I, I don't I don't Aaron Cash said that uh, Sheffield's being shifted to the bullpen how yeah. long has that been in the works so <clears throat> so today was was his turn to start but they're they've we, we're starting to transition him to the bullpen so that uh, hopefully he can get a couple outings under his belt um, down there and then, um, you know, play a part with us in our pen down the stretch. You know, we think obviously there's some great value that he could bring in our bullpen. Um, 
you know, for the end towards the end of his season and our season.